Order in the court. Currently, we have the case of Caleb King TV versus Denesto. What is your claim, uh, attorney for uh, Russian? I'm uh, sorry for Caleb. Well, Mr. Mr. Uh, judge guy, mine. Um, Caleb here was going to sell his uh, fish stand at Spawn, and he sold it to Mr. Denesto here, Danny. And Ow. well, you see, Danny hasn't paid his his rent for several months by now. And that's why we're here. We wanna we wanna put him behind bars. Maybe get him to pay a lawsuit. You know, one of those. Wow, this price keeps going up and up, man. Okay, and uh, Mr. Denesto, what's your counterclaim? Yes, no, stay in the court. <laughs> My counterclaim is the price is too much. This is blasphemy. Okay. Bad acting. Sorry. <laughs> right, so, so first we're going to go with the, you can't handle the truth. The defendant, Mr. Denesto, please return to yes. the court, or I'll have to shoot you. <laughs> Dan, wow, Dan, I feel like we're in Texas here. There's no like warning shots anymore. So the first witness, America, the stand is uh, Caleb, uh, Mr. Caleb King TV, uh, Mr. Russian. Feel free to question the witness, Caleb. King television. It's Caleb King the Virgin. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Well, I think I won this case. <laughs> what what was your starting price? What did well, you sell? My... What was the price uh, that this you sold outside? your fish shit to Dan? What was that price? Okay, well, listed on my price uh, sign, I had it listed at seven diamonds because, you know, I'm a hurting man. I needed seven diamonds. Uh, me and Denesto over there, he's a bad guy, by the way, um, we, uh, you, we were talking about it, and he said that he only had five diamonds. So I said, well, you can pay it down front. We signed a contract and everything. I have it, and I have it notarized if you want to see it, Judge. Russ, can you oh, hand that to him? Yes. Can Must I be a notary uh, public out of town. Uh, pu the, uh, the document? Oh. <laughs> Wow, from this position, looks like uh, looks Russ cheap. is trying to bribe you. <laughs> yes, it was uh, notarized to... <laughs> in the, the country of Mexico, but they said it would work in the States here on Alichno. Yeah, if Alichno's like, in the States. That, that, that's pure <laughs> evidence. <laughs> yeah, hmm, but we have a signature, and he paid a down payment of five diamonds and said he would pay it off by now. It was already supposed to be paid off. It was going to be one diamond a week, but he has failed to pay any diamonds at all other than the down price hmm all right mm -hmm. any mm -hmm. further questioning mm -hmm. mr russian Efferman? <clears throat> and when mr caleb king the virgin you you offered dan danny denesto denarino a better price did he decline no he accepted he accepted the better price well he accepted to have to pay a down payment of one diamond a week until he uh, paid up to the seven. Ah, uh, but he did not pay up to the seven. No, he still owes okay. two diamonds. So, so could you please stop the slapping in the court? I will have to uh, shoot people. I'm sorry. Woo! I mean, <laughs> thank you, thank you, Judge. All right, I'll sit back. Okay. Come back here, Kill. <clears throat> thank you, Judge. Thank you very much. Okay. No, 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 no. Go back to the stand. <laughs> Mr. Denesto has to question you now. Okay. Wait. No, oh, I guess since I'm representing myself, let me uh, get in this other chair. <clears throat> <clears throat> you have the floor, Mr. Denesto. Mr. Caleb King, the Virgin TV of the television tube. Red tube. May I ask? Hey, hey, hey. That, that's private. Shh. That's off the record. <laughs> if, I, if I may ask, Mr. Denesto over here, th this guy, this guy right here, mm -hmm. has mentioned to me that uh, he's actually paid his his diamonds, just somehow maybe got lost in the mail. May we blame the post office? Maybe. Whoever runs the post office in uh, in Mexico. Oh shit, that's for me. I mean, but <laughs> <let's> continue. <laughs> <laughs> 
But uh, it Should seems be that my uh, my defendant over there has actually paid indeed, and he's not being a scam artist or cheap or in any way, shape, or form of another cultural, meaning Jewish. No racist Boy, pun man. there. <laughs> Well, so I believe that this case has been adjourned and um, hold on. Well, we're gonna have to see the receipts that Your you wrote up for yourself, probably. Yes. Your Honor. I, is this an objection? I br objection. I bring yes. new evidence to the counter. As you can okay. see, in Mr. Danny's money package, he was trying to uh, blackmail Caleb King TV by putting cocaine in <sighs> Mr. Caleb's to make uh, Mr. Caleb go into jail instead of him. Judge, Judge, can we just mention that I sent these <laughs> off in Mexico? So there's there's no proof that uh, that's my cocaine. Hmm. If you're I'm sniffing, gonna, uh, I'm going to have to <laughs> overrule that objection. Continue, Mr. Dinesta. Woo. So, another question. another question, Mr. Caleb King TV. Is it true? That you don't have a mailbox in front of your house. I do. As if it. He does. Who's the postman here? Who is the postman here? The judge. Need him in for questioning. We can no, go take no, a little no, field I'm trip down to on the base. Postman, but I should be open like. We could all take a little field trip and bust out front and go on a zombie base. Check out my mailbox that's right in my front door or right in front. I don't think we need that. Okay, okay. Next question. Next question. I think we is should save do that to... because Dan seems like he's getting red there. Seems a little stuttery now. Mm -hmm. No, no. Uh, next question. Is it assuming that Your there Honor. is a bunch of thieves? No, no. Hey. You got to say objection. If you want to object, you say objection. Uh, mine. Uh, Overruled. Snoopy. Uh, uh, objection. Yes. <laughs> I believe that we should go check the front of Mr. Caleb's base for a mailbox. I agree. Let's go. No. The court will will be uh, briefly adjourned for a uh, field trip. Over to is your mailbox? Yes, it is. It's got mail in it, too, well, even. See, the question is that wow. I believe there is a similar <laughs> box at the front of a Mr. Longsword's castle. Is there not? Ooh. Uh, I don't know. We might have to go check. Ooh, very true. And there was very also true. a box containing the exact same amount of items. The box is empty. He, and it was labeled because he was the winner of second the Christmas place. Christmas or second place of the Christmas tree, the Christmas village, sorry, building competition. Wasn't that correct? Yeah, but so I got first place, so why would I have gotten Also, one? where is the sign marking this or the any any indication that this is your mailbox? You don't need a sign. That just bulges out. Why is it in the middle of your staircase? Yeah, that's what I'm trying to figure. We don't trip over that. I mean, you could just be running down and just, uh, and then, you know, break a leg right there. You know, I just think we should not question the mailbox placement and just question it because it is there. Right. Or not you question said, it. This, is, this evidence is objection. considered for the trial. All right. well, what's your objection? Because Caleb is last, was came last in the competition, why would he get a box of goodies. I'm going to check the official. Oh, knowledge. there's the real judge. <laughs> because everyone's a <laughs> winner. Oh my right. god. Tim, we're having a court session right now. I thought you were making fireworks. We are doing that as well. We are. Well, yes, <laughs> we are in a second. I don't think those are mutually exclusive, but okay. Okay. Right. Sorry. Well, I'm not sure if that, uh, I'm I'm going to dis I'm going to say this evidence is unfit for court and we're going to go back to the courtroom now. Yes. The Danesto, would you like to call <laughs> <laughs> Well no, we've got to wait until we're back at the courtroom. Oh yeah. Okay. Tim be ready. Be ready. That treehouse looks ready. Uh wouldn't I only be a witness? Is it a court by judge or Court by jury. Well, you can be the jury. Judge. Actually. Uh, actually, no, jury. Judge. Yeah, it's a small claims court, so it's the it's the magistrate only. Grand juries are usually resolved like murder and shit. Hey, Russ, thanks for the gift. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome, man. <laughs> Save your ass. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> I always go there too. <laughs> Am I still on sta on the stand here? Uh no, you can return to your seats, Mister okay. Mister King TV. Right, so. Uh, so Caleb has been questioned. Now it's up for Mr. Dinesto to be questioned by uh, Mr. Caleb King TV's uh, attorney. So, My uh, name is uh, Dinesto and I'm a alcoholic. And uh, Oh, sorry, wrong meeting. <laughs> wrong, wrong meeting, sorry. Well, <laughs> I meet here every Tuesday minute. and Thursday. Uh, ask your questions. Well, Daniel, Danny did Dan Arino. Is it true that on... Uh, when you shipped your package, you did indeed buy uh, track it, a, t a package tracker. So is, you uh, would be true. able to track the package. That's a tongue twister, wouldn't you? Package, tra <laughs> package tracker. Yeah. <laughs> One of the damn things. Excuse me, Mr. Kelp. Stop shining your attorney. <laughs> what do you have to say to that, Dan Arino? Well, what I would like to say in my defense is... Uh, you know, that uh, there's creepers around my house, there's a lot of mobs, and uh, it kind of blew I'm out my internet that. line. It blew out so, internet. yeah, so my internet line is now uh, no longer up and available to even track the package. Okay. And I don't have a phone, so that can't be tracked either and called. So. Do you have a tracking number? Uh, I do. It's uh, it's right here. It's, um, it's uh, 347229Z. That's my social security number. Hmm. Oh. I'm also just, just want to say I'm not a hacker. Hmm. But that's for another day. Okay, that's, well... Those are my Friday any meetings further here. Any questions, Mr. Afroman? No, Your Honor. Right. So, uh, Mr. Danessa, you can return to your seat. Thank you, Judge. And I might say, your sunglasses are looking mighty dandy there. I'm not wearing sunglasses. Get a, Shh, get a robe. Uh, three <laughs> glasses. <laughs> You if I might say, they make everything very, casual. uh... You bloody fucking casual. Anyway, <laughs> now it is time for my judgment. So, after hearing the evidence presented, it seems that I must vote in favour... <laughs> I see you're nodding. Um, I must say that I believe that Mr. Dinesto has indeed been deceiving to the court and must pay the, for the full pr price of seven diamonds. Yeah, boy! Uh, yeah, buddy! High yeah. five! No well, if I must... You'll never catch me alive! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think I kind of broke my leg running down the stairs. I'll, I'll come back up slowly. Can we leave I think the I, I, think I sprained now? my ankle. Here. <laughs> he's paying, he's paying. <laughs> okay, thank you, Mr. Dinesto. Was that seven you, diamonds? You count? Count? Here, you can count, Judge. Count. Okay. Yeah, I got diamonds. Run! Kill the judge. It worked. <laughs> no, it'll kill me. Uh, 